Hi, it's Randy Weddick from Band Pro Film and Digital. We're here at NAB 2017, and I'm going to talk to you about a few products we're excited about. Obviously, the probably most exciting thing at our booth is the Ingenue Easy Series lenses. There's the Easy One and Easy Two, and it's kind of like a mid-range lens and a wide lens, so a standard lens and a wide. They have convertible mounts on the back. They're very easy to change out between PL, EF, and E mount. And they also have a rear optical block that can be swapped out so that they start at a coverage of Super 35 with a stop of T2. And you can swap out the rear and give them 46.5 millimeter coverage to full frame or vista vision. And that takes it from a T2 to a T3. And also increases the focal length by one and a half times, but if you're going to a larger sensor, you're uh, kind of compensating for that anyway, so it's just maintaining the same field of view. These lenses are a pretty big accomplishment from our partnership with Ingenue and Jepson in that uh, they have the really stylish uh, look of an Ingenue lens, super cinematic, beautiful skin tone rendition, softness and sharpness, no breathing, but we were able to uh, bring them in at a quite a bit lower cost than uh, typical high-end cinematic lens from Ingenue, so um, we are uh, excited to offer these. Somewhere packages are between $10,000 and $27,000, depending on the accessories. Um, and we delivered our first one at the booth on Monday, so the deliver delivery schedule of these lenses begins now. So um, we have quite a few back orders, but uh, and we're always taking a tons of new orders. Uh, they're super popular lens, and. Uh, I'm really just happy to see that we're actually delivering them now. Because that's, if anyone's ever been involved in making lenses, they know there's a lot of trials and tribulations along the way, and a lot of delays. But once you start delivering, there's kind of you know that's a, that's a huge milestone. So we've uh, we're really happy about that here. Um, another thing that I will be showing you is the Raptor lenses. Um, kind of keeping in the same theme of lenses that cover both uh, Super 35 and large sensor Raptors will cover. Uh, a very large sensor. We've uh, worked with them to cover uh, even Alexa 65s in some scenarios. Um, they're a 100 millimeter lens, 150 millimeter, and 180 millimeter macro lens. They're all T2.9, and they all make the same magnification ratio, which is one to one. And that means basically whatever your size of your sensor is, you can make an image of an item, a real life item that is that size. So if the sensor is the size of your thumbnail. You can make an image the size of a thumbnail uh, to cover the entire screen. And what that means is that you can get kind of the same shot and the same magnification with three different focal lengths. But um, the reason you'd want a longer lens, like a 180, is so that you can get that same level of magnification. But if you're doing like a special effects shot, or if you're doing fire, explosions, water, something like that, you can be farther backed off and be getting the same magnification. It also helps you uh, play around with depth of field and depth of focus. They have really super beautiful rendition. They're super sharp, and they have tremendous ability to operate in backlight, um, even at the most close focus. So they have an achromatic design, basically. So if you're shooting super high-end product shots against really brightly lit white seamless with hard edges turning around and stuff like that, you're not going to get any purple and green fringing. So they're kind of like a top flight macro photography lens. We've delivered them to some of the higher end macro customers out there recently and uh, those are also shipping which I am uh, pretty happy about. So a lot of times you see products at NAB that uh, are just announced and you want to know when they're coming out you know and uh, like it takes forever and with lenses it kind of you know it does take a long time often but uh, these are kind of our two key products the EZ series zooms and the Raptor macros and we're delivering them both right now. Other than that, we have recently taken on the Panasonic Cinema line of cameras. Um, so we are showing uh, some footage, a test film was shot using the EZ zooms and a Vericam LT. And uh, using the Vericam LT, we, we shot a film that had a lot of differing color contrast. We wanted to experiment a lot with secondary colors, which are like magenta, cyan, yellows that don't often render perfectly on RGB sensor cameras. and. Uh, also wanted to use the 5000 ISO, 800 ISO, dual ISO architecture in that camera. And that allows you to uh, shoot with the same amount of dynamic range in a very dark scene as you would also have in a bright scene. I mean, so you can, it's not just like gaining up an image, it's like changing the performance characteristics of the camera itself. 
and it allows you to operate shooting in a nighttime environment just like you'd operate in a daytime environment. I mean, there's a lot of stuff we shot with just street lights, but it doesn't, it's not like an orange washout. You can just like see all these different colors into the shadows from all the different lights. You can see blue, orange, yellow, green, and um, there's a lot of ability to see saturated colors in the shadows on this camera. So it's a really interesting camera for making a certain kind of image, um, and it, I think it's a, it makes a really beautiful picture. Anyways, thanks for stopping by our booth, and I hope you enjoyed the NAB 2017 coverage, and we'll see you guys around.